Welcome back to Blackjack. Hi. I am uh, got my Komori Khan shirt on because I... <clears throat> I don't really have experience with either of these shows. I watched a little bit of Bleach, and uh, that was about it. Um, <clears throat> I mean, anything with Jameson Price in it, I'll give it a go. And yes, I know he's in Naruto as well. So... <clears throat> Athena's not with me right now. She's right across the room enjoying a nice breakfast. Eat that cereal. It's good for you. She's just staring at me. And stop throwing your broccoli all over the floor. I mean, oh good. You're eating your cereal, girl. Okay. <clears throat> Parakeets are going to be going off. And I hope the computer is not going off at any point. So anyway... I just wanted to say, I'm kind of starting uh, on the base with these. Uh, okay. Don't really have much experience. The Holy Shonen Trinity. What the heck? Big three. Any long time what? reader of Shonen the? Jump will recognize these. No, some get those of the captions titles right. in manga and anime history. And it's time for two of those shonen heroes to throw down. Naruto Who would have thought one of the Ninja biggest, of the hidden one of the biggest manga characters the of all time would be a kid and in a, in a weapons, armor, orange jumpsuit. To find out who would win a death battle. I'm going to turn it down in these headphones. It's got a little plug here. Konoha, the village hidden in the leaves, is a pretty quiet it's town. It's like really loud. Not what I'd expect for a city village. It's really loud. <laughs> Still, there was at least one troublemaker among the bunch. I'm turn it down the on the side here. Ninja, Naruto it's on eight. Uzumaki. I'm home, everyone! Naruto Uzumaki has returned to the Hidden Leaf Village! Orphaned at a young age and ostracized by his peers, Naruto because of course he is. Studious, but he had great aspirations. <clears throat> his goal was to become the town's Hokage, which is a fancy word for ninja governor. The only Yay. way Naruto could reach such a prestigious position hey, look, was to excel in ninja school, like Ninja Harry Potter. Though he should yeah. really find a place that'll teach him not to dress like a clown <laughs> and run like a real human being. <laughs> what does he think he is? An airplane? You just Actually, know likely to Gladion does resistance. that wrong. Which could be beneficial when moving at superhuman speeds, where angular momentum is a smaller factor. I remember when you ran like that in middle school. research. Sure whiz. Anyway, well, never do what he student. He still tried his hardest to reach his goal. Hang on a second. I'm getting some, uh... Oh! I'm actually getting some stuff over in this corner today. Naruto failed to graduate from the academy three times. Damn. In Buddhism and Hinduism ideologies, chakras are, Sorry about in that. terms, gates within the human body which Killer can be you enlightenment. But the ninja in Naruto's Kami? world had a slightly different interpretation. Oh, say, they weaponized it. Naruto can use chakra for all sorts of flashy attacks. He can heal himself, seal monsters away, walk up walls, or even stand on water like a ninja Jesus. He's learned a number of chakra techniques, or jutsus, oh. and he's uh, developed a few new ones of his own. Cologne from Ronmo and Half to do that. Oh, God! Well, Cologne is really walking on water. She, she balances on a tiny little tree. And paste himself over and over and over again. <sighs> Unlike the standard Not going to talk about sexy jutsu. With their own combat capabilities. By dividing his chakra between himself and his clothes, it's really impossible to distinguish the real Naruto from the fakes. And he can get pretty tricky when he makes thousands of them. But when strategies can't save the day, extremely adept at developing complex shadow clone techniques gun. on the fly. By that sounds good. He's adaptable. Hand, Naruto creates a compact ball of energy which can blast through solid stone. While the so it's a little bit of years to learn. He came Naruto big. figured it out after training for just over a week. He's invented the <sighs> He's the Sakura Kasugato of ninjas. is the Rasen Shuriken. By combining the resistance. I didn't even see that something about level one shadow clone. He uses it to turn the spinning ball into a spinning blade. Nice. This baby can trap you in a vortex of wind so sharp yeah. it mess you up at a cellular level. Naruto has cool. all other techniques up his orange sleeves, including summoning. It's gonna come to that. I have a feeling. Juices. He can even transform into a. 
Oh, still got the. Looks like he's been studying. I guess that's one plus side to not having parents. You don't need to worry about anyone walking in on you. Why most? Except the bike stop sellers. Chakra, everyone has a limit. The more physical and spiritual energy one possesses, the more chakra they'll have at their disposal. Just like the gas tank from a chainsaw. Thanks to his heritage, Naruto already has a great deal of chakra. Even still, he has far oh, more man. than he reasonably should. All <laughs> thanks to the beast within. Yeah, he's got a monster in his stomach. Let's backtrack a few years. On the day of Naruto's birth, his village was attacked by a chakra beast known as the Nine-Tailed Fox. A monster so destructive, a mere swing of its tails could level a mountain. In desperation, yeah, you take it to Hawaii. sacrificed himself to split the Nine-Tails in two, sealing one half within his own son, Naruto. Oh, his first ever birthday gift to his son was a giant pet fox that can destroy cities? <laughs> I wish he was my dad. Eventually, I'm getting high CPU usage, so I really hope it don't crash. First. Foxy would threaten to eat Naruto, Naruto would whack him over the head with a big shrine gate, you know, typical roommate drama. Still, they eventually became friends. <coughs> right, Dina. The fox's name was Kurama. Afterward, Kurama would yeah. share his chakra with Naruto on a regular basis. And as a immeasurable chakra reserve, Kurama's reserves are just turn it into some freaking us or his wrath right here. Fingertips, Naruto can enter a bunch of different super okay. forms. Up, Who could Saito. stand up to Asura? Like something he'd learn from an old I want. I want to know. Right? Nope. He learned it from a frog. This state increases all of Naruto's physical abilities. Furthermore, Sage Mode allows Naruto to perceive the entire hey. area around him. Okay. And How do you even pierce your nose like that? Jutsu. You have to go in from the sides and he's seeking but balls. He's not careful, he'll turn into a frog. No, I'm. I'm not kidding. With Kurama's chakra, hey, this show is weirder than I thought it was. Which drastically increases physical prowess and energy output. Best of which is the Nine Tails Chakra Mode. Flame on! It got even better when he befriended Mr. Fox, upgrading to the stronger, faster, tougher Kurama Chakra Mode. Chakra Mode grants is he just flying above the planet for negative emotions and the ability to create additional chakra arms. Whoa, that's a lot of hands! It is us for his wrath! Overwhelming attacks, extra maneuverability, creating rocks and shurikens, the works. Yeah, that's not what I was. Can oh, he come? Yeah. Can also okay. So can, like so can he combine that with other things? Like, can he do sexy jutsu and that? Because I'm so pretty sure that's where it's a It's a butt. And for his final form, it's spoilers. Teratons. Dang. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. I just All of this chakra sniffling. stuff started with an alien named Kaguya. Who ate a fruit oh, the princess from the movie. Chakra. Later, she got all murder happy, so her son stopped her. One of these sons, the Sage of Six Paths, had his own son named Ashura, and Naruto is a reincarnation of him. Of course yeah. he is! Naruto's kind of an alien. Through this connection, Naruto is <laughs> a form of energy. Aren't we all turning to Carl Sagan anyway? His gets Gosh, I'm so sorry, I just keep sniffling. And he can use truth-seeking balls, which are orbs of chakra that can transform into weapons and destroy anything they touch. Oh, they he don't actually all these forms find and further truth. add natural energy to his Kurama avatar to form Six Paths Ashura Kurama Sage Mode. Whew. Good God, that's a confusing amount of forms. Anyway, Naruto is also an expert in hand-to-hand -hand combat and could run faster than the eye could see when he was just 12 years old. He's dodged a lightning speed punch from the fourth Raikage, a feat considered comparable to his father, who could teleport. He even dodged this light speed loogie. Uh, according to the fourth data oh, book, God. this light fang attack does indeed move at light speed, over 670 million miles per hour. He's tough enough to survive getting stabbed. Have his soul ripped out, or get smacked in the face with a beam that can slice the freaking moon apart. Yep, this is some of his wrath shit. He's fought multiple tailed beasts at once, left a statue weighing several hundred tons, survived a fall from the clouds, gone toe to toe he with an invisible the limbo sun goddess, and pulverized six falling meteorites simultaneously. His chakra is so tough, he can power through Amaterasu and fire jutsu with flames so strong oh, that they burn other it's flames. It's not the actual Amaterasu. He can make new eyeballs for blind people. What's up with that? 
Oh, and in his final fight with rival and possibly closet boyfriend Sasuke, <laughs> his power was so great they obliterated miles upon miles of land, changing the weather and disintegrating a lake. Only then, I would after defeating Sasuke, kind of saving the world from Kaguya, be and reuniting the split halves of Kurama, Naruto finally achieved his dream and became Hokage. Yay! I mean, he <laughs> named his son Burrito. Boruto. Yeah, close enough. <laughs> I'm gonna run away. I never go back on my word. Are those supposed to look like fox whiskers? Is that my ninja way? Or does he just have some unfortunate facial hair? Because that does not look like Shinigami. little marks like on Anthony. It may sound like a foreign word to some, but you all know what it is. The Death God. The Grim Reaper of Souls. Ever. And a 17-year-old ginger with a badass sword. Ichigo Kurosaki seemed like a pretty normal kid growing up doing well in school and learning martial arts from his father. Except there was one little oddity. He could see ghosts. Oh, yeah. From the sixth sense. I see dead people. All grown up. One day when he was nine years old and walking home with his mother, young Ichigo noticed what he thought was a girl about to fall into a river. So naturally, he ran over to rescue her like the brave little kid he was. Except it wasn't really a girl at all. It was a hollow. A monster spawned from an abandoned human soul. Let me guess, and it killed his mother. Yep. Killed his mother. Yep. Bummer. Reminds me of how I lost my poor mama boomstick. Oh, she always hated that ghost in the barn. Right. Well, mama boomstick invited them over for Thanksgiving. Later, when he met a woman <laughs> named Rukia, who held the illustrious job title of Shinigami, or Soul Reaper. I like a guardian Smith. of the dead who keeps balance like the universe Rukia. by helping those who have passed move on to the afterlife. Otherwise, they turn into violent columns. And if you show a blade to work and it doesn't work out, the Soul Reaper can always cut hollows down with their awesome swords, like Samurai Ghostbusters. Anyway, the two of them got into a bind, and Rukia had to share some of her power with Ichigo. Turns out, he was a surprise Soul Reaper all along. By stabbing him? When accessing his Shinigami power, Ichigo leaves his physical body for a new one made up of Reishi. Or spiritual matter, which makes him invisible to everyone in the ah. world, despite still being physically present. And his new powers make him super deadly. So he's he an astral projection of himself. Through giant monsters with ease, survive being they will blip his blocks and even fly through the air. It's more accurate to say he walks through the air, using naturally occurring reishi as footholds. But let's get to the dicey part. That sounds that actually awesome a lot better. Sword. Despite my love of birds, I'm also afraid of heights. So if I had like a firm platform, whatever I want. My god, that is a snake knife. Well, a within themselves, which manifests as their sword. Ichigo's is called Sangetsu. Well, both of them are. No, here we go. Strap in, because this shit's about to get crazy. Ichigo actually has two different Zampakto spirits drawn from his weird and confusing heritage. Hello. All right, so long story short, Ichigo's a soul reaper because his dad is too. But he's also part Quincy, which is a human with crazy powers, because that's what his mom was. But he's also part hollow because his mom was possessed by a hollow called White, and White got passed on to him when he was born. Oh, and he's also part Fullbringer, but nobody cares about Fullbringers. One of Ichigo's what? inner spirits is a manifestation of his Quincy side inherited from his mother, while the other is a fusion of his Shinigami power and the Hollow. Unfortunately, Shinigami. So, was there like some epic fight with him, his mom, and the Hollow then? To find a balance between these two sides, Ichigo learned plenty of neat techniques, like his bread and uh, butter attack, the Getsuga Tenjo. Tenjo! By concentrating his Reatsu, or spiritual pressure, through his sword, Ichigo can launch a massive slashing attack. Call it like it is, Wiz. It's a sword beam. Disintegrate ordinary humans into mere fire from a close, or even blast two of them at once. I from his only dream of that kind of aura present. Vina, a temporary defense which grants inhuman durability. From his Shinigami temporary, training, huh? he developed exceptional sword skills and is he fighting a squally in heart, which greatly enhances his speed. But there's one That's really close big jacket. Deal we haven't talked about yet. One time. Over the course of his career battling hollows and protecting his friends, Ichigo has attained many, many different superpowered forms. Starting with the base Shinigami form, Shikai. Despite essentially Skull being Skull Clad does not sound all that strong. Block an attack from the Sokyoku. 
said to have power equal to one million Zampakta. The next step was Bunkai. Normally it takes ten years to reach this form, but Ichigo did it in just two days. Boss. <laughs> When using okay, so he's Once able to learn high tech or high level techniques faster greater. than Naruto. And according to the official data book, while in Bankai, Ichigo moves like lightning. Wait, why does his sword shrink when he goes God -like, Bankai? But Shouldn't it be bigger? What kind of God? <laughs> Technically, yes, but Ichigo can control its size to keep it more manageable. If Shinigami couldn't Makes minimize sense. their blades, <laughs> some would have swords the size of skyscrapers. Awesome! Anyway, the hollow inside wanted a piece of the action, too. So Ichigo gained a new power boost with a spoofy hollow mask. This form is Visor. enough to lift five iron pillars, each wing near yeah, I see cosplays of that, but I always thought well, it was not careful, just like he was wearing a mask. Body, sending him into a violent berserker state commonly referred to as Vasto Lorde. Despite the lack of consciousness, Vasto Lorde Ichigo could heal quickly. Oh yeah, that's right. To show his fanboy Lorde. Spanish. He's powerful enough to nuke a city. After some quality training with his dad, Ichigo got a sort of second fun guy. Is that As most people call him Dungai Ichigo. Wrapping around his form, arm. He shattered mountains without even trying. Five ninety-three ton iron pillars. Attack, nice. Which distorts time and space, which sounds like a black hole. Right after that, he survived a shot so freaking big, the explosion could be seen for miles. By comparing yeah. this crater to those left by real-life bomb tests. I'd estimate the attack to have a maximum explosive yield of 814 kilotons of TNT. Okay, That's so like Ichigo surviving Naruto boys to the face. <laughs> survived more than no, that. No, 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 I meant, I meant the bomb from 1945, not the, oh, God. Uh, well, try as those little boys might, all it did to Ichigo was burn his arm, and he didn't even care. This guy isn't Just sound like Naruto's more adorable, though. Don Guy Ichigo literally becomes Getsuga Tensho itself. I know well, it's confusing, but just cuter at a pinch of peach sort of way. Powerful <laughs> which busted up one of the biggest baddies in the whole series. But right. also sacrificed all of Ichigo's power. Well, that's a real deal. But 17 months later, he managed all to. Oh, listen, he still keeps up with Ichigo's hair. Powers, which Otherwise, it physical abilities, just wouldn't. But then he lost those two. It's worth noting that days. while in full bring Shikai, his My aunt never even has a pendant! As strong as his old Getsuga Tensho. But he still didn't give up. After training with some top tier Soul Reapers and eating some food which gave him Super Reatsu, nice. the moment came. My in chopsticks the most won't stop! Of all time, an entire sea disintegrated to form his new true Shikai. Nice. Complete with not one, but twos and gets That doesn't look like a whole scene. Finally balancing the Shinigami, the Hollow, and the Quincy within, Ichigo had reached his full potential. He tamed his Vasto Lorde form, merging it with his Quincy side. In this form, he can combine his Getsuga Tensho with one of the strongest <laughs> Hollow attacks, the Grand Ray Sarah. He also made a trip that normally takes a week in only 9 hours and 15 minutes. And last okay. but not least, he achieved a brand new level of Bankai. Which was immediately well, crushed by a small really? dude who planned to destroy the universe named... He what? You what? He what? It's probably inspired by the Hebrew name for God, Yahweh, and, and the katakana ends with a sharp cut sound, so... You walk? Yeah, what you gonna do? Well, we can assume this fun guy works. How did they say it in the show, though? Increasing its physical speed and strength along with his Riatsu tenfold. Even How did they change his name for it because they couldn't figure out it? <laughs> that is an impressive after, Until his kid became a soul reaper. <laughs> what do you name him? Bitch ago? What? No, it's Kazui. Uh, I might have got him mixed up with the other uh, enchilada kid or whatever. Eh, close enough. <laughs> Does it just like end on that? Yeah, more of friendship. Yes. All right, the combatants are set. Let's end this debate once and for all. But first, did you know that Naruto and Ichigo are named after food? Yep. Maybe you can find them in your next box from Blue Apron. No. No way. Don't want to see any of it. Okay, hang on. I went a little farther than that. Okay, here we go. Okay, it sounds like Naruto is a lot more powerful and a lot more durable. But it's also going to be a hell of a fight. Okay. So my money right now is on Naruto. Everything in this area is going to get destroyed, isn't it? 
birds, the fish, the rocks, the waterfall, the mountain. Is that hollow? Naruto, I sense a presence. Hey. Naruto, wake up. Hey, asshole, wake up. That looks a lot like Naruto's actual voice actress. Sounds... Did I say sounds or did I say look? I don't know. But you all know what I mean. Are we gonna find out what happens if someone attacks Ichigo in that form? Yeah. Like when he separates from his body, what happens when someone attacks his body? I don't think they got into that, did they? RIP MY FACE OFF! Right? I don't think punching a sword yields that noise. <laughs> really? Yeah, not bad, but I'm still gonna beat your ass. Give me a freaking break. How to surprise the forest has lasted as long as it has. Is that the best you can do? No. It never is. I didn't hear no bell! Kurama! I'm sick of this music. Straight up, punch the god out of him! What's a t-shirt say? Oh, there goes the forest. Through you, bastard! Yep! Phew. Who was that guy? There goes the waterfall. Sorry, Bleach fans. I know you all really wanted to win, but unfortunately, this wasn't it. Naruto had better training. A broader Does that mean it's gonna be it in the future? Factor. And Ichigo's invisible ghost buddy didn't really matter. Are we gonna get Rukia later on? Be invisible, but they're still present in the physical realm and can be touched by normal people. Kurama can look <laughs> by simply sensing their emotions. So every time you touch your arm out, you feel like you're touching something. And with six paths power, he could see and fight Madara's limbo clones, even though they were on a totally separate plane of existence. Also, okay. keep in mind that while Chakra and Reishi it's like some bayonetta shit right they there. They both contain spiritual energy. Let's talk speed. Naruto can dodge light speed attacks and can move faster than lightning. A lightning bolt's return stroke is 220 million miles per hour, about one third the speed of light. Ichigo has also displayed lightning fast speeds and even greater. Near the end of the series, Ichigo took a trip that should have taken seven days, but instead took nine hours and 15 minutes. It's likely Sounds good. Who was referencing his accomplice's speed, like Ichibe, who can knock his foes 2,440 miles away. And nice. To him in a second. You watch a guy beat him by going twice as fast, so we'll